Code sent. Now we need to get to that airstrip. We gonna rock all the way to Media Luna, boss? I had another plan in mind. One of those crates outside ought to be fueled up. Smart. Reed's men won't shoot one of their own, and the buyer won't see us coming. Who's up to date on their flight reviews? Hey, a Santa Blanca LT in the HQ building. The drone is up. I can't see squat. The drone's being jammed. I see a second target. Hang back, they see it. Wounded that bird on patrol. Watch out. That guy just switched on. Must have heard the gunshot. Hey now, we've got a group of 
Sicario, Stoker. Got eyes on the buyer. Area. Careful who you shoot. We still need that scumbag alive. T's and detainees again. Bet you love, he don't need to die. I have a shot. Engage him. Silencio, Marche. Well, that was messy as shit. Pero por favor. Por favor, no me lastime. I'm just a businessman. Boston Reed, where is he? I don't know where he is, okay? Uh, everything goes through his middleman. I, I make an order and he delivers it, that's it. An order for what? People, okay? Men, women, you know. What happens to these people you buy? Depends. Most of the girls end up as sex slaves. The men get put to work. Some just get cut up and used for their organs. You know how much a young kidney's worth? Holy shit, you pay in cash? Usually, yeah. Fucking suitcases full. Usually? Last time I came up short, it was a rush order and I didn't have enough money on hand. Had to wire the rest to one of Reed's bank accounts. Motherfucker was pissed. But what else could I do? I want the name of the bank and the account number. Sure, yeah. I I'll write it down, and then we're done here, right? You go your way, and I go mine, right? I'm starting to put the pieces together. I'll upload the bank info to Bowman. Between that and the list of villages... To Dad bird on patrol. Watch out. Bowman, this is Nomad. We're on the ground in Okoro. What have you got for us? Okoro is the heart of cocaine production in Bolivia. The network there was built by El Yayo and predates Santa Blanca by more than a decade. When El Yayo joined the cartel and became the boss of production, he handed Okoro off to his grand... This is Bowman. I've been working on the intel you got from Kwani, and I think I've got a line on Reed. Let's hear it. I cross-referenced security camera footage at recent. Hola, ¿qué tal? You hear anything about the cartel or the Sicarios around here? Gracias. It's Nomad again. Sorry about the interruption. No problem. I cross-referenced security camera footage at Reed's bank with suspected human traffickers operating around the villages you provided. Got two hits. Brothers Carlos and Fernando Guerrero, a.k.a. Los Enteradores. The Undertakers. Nasty pieces of work. They specialize in snatching people right out of their beds. If half of what the locals say about them is true, they're a pair of fucking monsters. We're sure they're working for Reed? They withdrew funds from the bank account you gave me a couple of days ago. Where can I find these assholes? Triangulating off their cell phones now. Stand by for coordinates. This shows where we can find a deactivated rebel radio transmitter. We should go put it back on the air. Got a hit on Carlos's phone. I'm sending you his location now. You don't send... Like that's a good thing. Carlos is the dumb one. It's his brother Hernando that's most likely got info on Reed. We need to find Carlos. Follow him to his brother Hernando. Just be careful. If Carlos catches you following him, he'll find some way to warn Hernando. We'll never catch him then. Understood. You'll never know we're there. Open fire. Open the hornet's nest. Hey, 
It's me. Sorry about that. About time. I was starting to get worried. When El Yayo joined the cartel and became the boss of production, he handed Okoro off to his grandson, who goes by the name El Emisario. The Emissary. He spends most of his time outside the province, rubbing shoulders with politicians in Sucre and greasing the wheels of the cartel. Not really his job, but the guy's something of a charmer, and he figures this is the best way to make his grandfather proud. El Yayo lets it slide so long as Okoro continues to produce. The fact is, the network is so well established that it pretty much runs itself. El Emisario's assistant handles the rest. Get in there, gather intel on Okoro's production sites, and start fucking things up. That'll put pressure on El Emisario to come back to Okoro and get things back on- Hold on. We got cut off. It's okay. Now where were we? Get in there, gather intel on Okoro's production sites, and start fucking things up. That'll put pressure on El Emissario to come back to Okoro and get things back on track before Granddad finds out. When that happens, we grab him and use him to get to El Yeo. Getting an upload from Bowman. Looks like she's got some intel on El Emissario. You all know El Yayo, highest ranking Bolivian in the Santa Blanca cartel, and their head of cocaine production. But you may not know his grandson, Gonzalo Yana, aka El Emisario, the Emissary. Yayo taught Emisario everything he knows. How to produce the best polvo in all of South America, how to maintain relationships with the local Bolivians, and most importantly, how to serve your Santa Blanca masters. Emisario looks up to Yayo, would do anything to honor him, to make him proud. Which is exactly what makes El Emisario the perfect target. His greatest fear is shaming his grandfather. If we hit his coke operation in Okoro, he'll come running back to fix things. That's when we grab him. With a little luck, he'll give us everything we need to know about dear old grandpa. Signed, sealed, and delivered. Now the Rebels can come claim it. Hope that makes them get use of whatever's inside it. I'd hate to think we came all this way for nothing. Come on, let's go. Stay well, you're gonna see you. Hold up. Katrine, I come all the way out here to see you, and it's like talking to a wet sock. Honestly. Check it out. We've got a location on a cocaine factory operating out of a converted slaughterhouse here in Okoro. What are we waiting for? Let's go light that shit up. Just one problem. Factory door requires a key code to open it. So where do we get the code? According to this, El Emisario's assistant has We need to track him down. We know we're here. Be careful.
Compañero. David Rocha de su mujer me pegó. Quiero que este hombre es público de puta con una lanza. La revolución vencerá. I'll pilot. I'm on. Seen us. The making a run for it. Looks like the cartel is operating a cocaine lab on board a converted fishing boat near Camp Oana. This is just the kind of target we're looking for. Taking out the lab will turn up the heat on El Misario and force him into the open. They're going to be on top of us in another few seconds. What do we do? Got the location of a cartel metal they're planning on giving to some Billy Badass. Get to cover. Move. Find the access code to the cocaine factory in Okoro. Once you've got the code, get inside and wreck the place.
Ready? Fire, fire, fire. We'll go. Heads up. I've got eyes on the assistant. Watch your shots. We still need him to talk. Fire, fire, fire. Ah, fuck! Oh shit! Oh shit! Use me! Don't kill me! Por favor! I have a family! The access code to the cocaine factory. What is it? I've got two boys. Two little ones. Mis chiquitos, Gustavo and Felipe. I've got pictures. You want to see them? No, I don't want to see the damn pictures. Just give me the access code and we're done. Pero que es eso? What's the matter? You don't like kids or something? Jesus. You want to go home to Gustavo and Felipe? Just give me the damn number. Tu bueno. Mire, it's 654-375. That's it, I swear. Bowman, I got the code. I'm sending you a virus to upload into the factory's automation software. It'll screw with the... ...chemical processing in subtle ways that'll spoil the coke, then break the machines when someone tries to remove it. That'll cause Santa Blanca a lot of product and take the factory out of action for months. Inside the factory, we take out control systems and cocaine stocks. Then we get the hell out. Get in, run around, and break shit. Copy that. We got hostiles in the area. I got a narco over here. Near the turret. Okay, we're in. We'll hit the control room first. Copy that. There's a weapons case over here. Controls are foobard. That'll shut the factory down for months. Where to next? Let's search the warehouses. We take out any cocaine stocks we find, then we exfil. Copy that. Control room must have shorted the locks. Stack up and sweep the building. Take an end. Wait. 
Frag out. Get some. I'm engaging tangles. Frag out. There's a stockpile. Let's take it out. I got the C4 primed. Eyes up. Let's get back to work. Stack up and sweep the building. Take out any contained stocks you find. Roger that. Stockpile destroyed. Let's go. 